And we're live! Yes, yes! We're live! Who's here? Uh, I can't see the blinking what it's... I think Marcus is here. I just need to do a refresh on this page so I can get to um, the live stream chat feed. Ed's here. Hi, Ed. And here we go. <clears throat> yes, yes, it's an evening with Doug and Joe. And... Uh, the music of ethnicis. Ethnesis. So, can you see the chat feed okay? Not really, I can't see it for the phone. Can't you? Yeah. Hang on a minute, then. let me see if I can... <coughs> Is that better? Uh, yeah. You see that now? So, Ed's here. Oh, Dave. Hi, Dave. Thanks for coming. Um, we're well, getting a bit worried, mate. I didn't know, wouldn't, did, I didn't, didn't know where you were for ages and ages. So, this is Joe. <laughs> As you already, already know. So, Melvin, yeah, this stuff, Melvin, this is not the stuff. So, all this stuff, hi, Stan. All the, hi, Hoz is here. Dean's here as well. All the stuff you're going to hear tonight uh, doesn't exist anywhere. I don't know if that's strictly true. Well, it might. There's a few bits and pieces on YouTube. This track isn't that we're going to play first. So, this track, this first track, <laughs> that was Watson. I've just stood on him. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't stand on me. So the first track we're going to play is called "Watching," and it's uh, well, it's about it's about being a it's about being a voyeur. It's about voyeurism. You know, we used to live in an, a, a, a not that we're voyeurs. Okay, I just want to make that absolutely clear. All right, uh, we used to live in an. Uh, is that what? What's it about? Uh, I don't, what's it called? Watching. It's the the one the one where. Oh, you're... I'll tell you afterwards. I can't remember. Okay, so Joe will tell you since he wrote the lyrics. He can't remember what she wrote the blinking thing about now. You know, seriously. What? Don't be, uh, I can see everything you're doing. I know you can. Right, okay, so we'll get on with it, and we're going to play this first track. Uh, yes, what's it now? He's he, He's been stood on. <laughs> right, okay, so this one's called Watching. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Have caught them on TV. The 
shut us down at number 30 Jessie's entertaining again But her husband comes home early Oh dear me, something will hit the fan Looking down from my apartment window There are different lights I can see I stand quietly by and watch them Living my life vicariously Looking down from my apartment window There are different lights I can see I stand quietly by and watch them Living my life vicariously But who is watching me? I wonder So that one was called Watching. Watching is basically about voyeurism, is it not? Uh, possibly, yes. Yeah, oh but not me. No, not you. No. <laughs> of course not. So just let me explain a few things. Yeah, all these songs were recorded in 2010 when we were living in Spain. And um, my very, very first video on YouTube is of the studio tour of that. And uh, that's where all or everything you listen to, basically, more or less everything you listen to is recorded. Um, and it was none of it was recorded with a DAW at all. Uh, everything was recorded with a Boss BR sixteen sixteen track recorder, hardware recorder. Um, so uh, there's no MIDI, so everything's recorded live. Uh, there are obviously drum machines and stuff like that, but some of the drums are live. If it sounds like a guitar, it probably is. Um, so this one is called. Uh, African drum and uh, it's kind of self-explanatory uh, what it's about so I uh, you hope you enjoyed this one Disease and triumph through the thoughts. 
So, yeah, kind of self-explanatory lyrics there. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so all these no, ethnesis, ethnesis is me and Joe. That's what we what we were called when we were recording all this stuff and we had the studio and everything. And So that's what it was. The studio was called Fourth Floor because it was on the fourth floor of an apartment building, which is probably why Joe wrote uh, watching. <laughs> you can see all the other people in the apartments over the road. <coughs> <clears throat> do you not remember that bloke? What bloke? Oh, oh yeah, I do. Well, we won't go into that sordid little story, will we? <laughs> right, anyway. So, uh, David Poo, what's the difference between ethnesis and I ghost? No, I'll tell you what. I'll, here you go. Here, here it is. I'll tell you what it is, Dave. Ethnesis is the name of the band. I ghost was a song. I'll play it for you now. Uh, it's a, it's a, it's a happy little number. <laughs> it's not really a happy little number, but it's not a it's not a horrible it's not a horrible song. If try and listen to the words because the words are, are really uh, quite good. Uh, actually, it was originally a poem that I wrote like, in the eighties, and then years years later, Joe rewrote it to suit the song. So this is uh, I ghost I I ghost. I ghost. So this is I ghost. Let's see. Here we go. But try and listen to the lyrics. So, you know.
So that was, that was, that was, stop it. That was I Ghost. Yes, yes. So we, well, we were in Spain. Somebody there, proper, proper scammed us. And uh, so I, we, we'd, I'd, we'd, we'd written this song and we got all the music done and everything. And then I'd, uh, I'd gone away. And then Joe, Joe took over the, uh, the actual, the, 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 the what's it, the, the Boss BR-16 recorder. And they uh, did all these lyrics and stuff. So this track is is got quite a, I don't know, it's quite a vicious song, isn't it? Really, it's a bit liar. liar. Yeah. yeah. So this is called Liar, <clears throat> Liar. Uh, so I'm gonna say, I just jump into the door now, and uh, yeah. So this one, I just have to check something because I'm running these from Dropboxes. <laughs>
So that was <laughs> that was liar. Okay, so it, in shortly, shortly, I'm going to play you a track called um, Marrakesh. Um, we were originally going to call the, the the group Marrakesh. Where did you guys start the dance portion? <laughs> yeah, we don't do dance, Rustic. Uh, we're professionals. You've put your pole away, haven't you? We've set. Oh, don't tell them I put my pole away. Um, we are professionals. <laughs> we're serious musicians. <laughs> Saxophone with bacon. Yeah, it could be. Uh, right, okay, so uh, I'm going to play with track, not the next one. I'm going to play one, one called O'Malley's. <clears throat> um, we, I really wanted to, Joe likes jazz. Joe, Joe likes jazz. Joe likes jazz. It sounds like a band. Right, so uh, this one's called O'Malley's. And then I'm going to play you a track that's called uh, uh, Marrakesh, but I'll explain a little bit more about that because it's quite a, quite a song. Um, anyway, here is uh, O'Malley's. It's... Uh, what is it about, Cho? It's about Lady of the Night. The Lady of the Night. It's about the Lady of the Night. Okay. 
Hey, that was a whole malice. And we wanted to do like a slinky, jazzy, sexy, kind of smoky, smoky filled bar type thing with a typey vibe, barry type vibey thing. Okay, so, okay, so this track, I'm going to play you now. Excuse me. I'm going to sec. And let's get it to, to what's it? Right, this track I'm going to play you now is called Marrakesh. We were originally going to call what became Ethnesis, we were going to call it Marrakesh. Um, th then we decided to call it Ethnesis, and then we thought, well, I mean, it's a great, it's a great Marrakesh. It's a great word, isn't it? It's, it's, it just sums up so much stuff. So we wrote this song, right? And it ended up as being, it's six parts, this song. So it's a, it's a long song. It's like 17 minutes, but. It, it it varies. It's six. It's six separate tracks, basically, all kind of glued together, just like prog, basically. All the same. Oh, thanks, thanks, our 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 RPJ Kingdom just super chartered. What kind of bass are you using? Uh, the same bass as we've got now, which is the uh, Hello. yes. Uh, this we've the only bass we've got. The only bass we've had for years and years and years and years, which is a PV grind. Um, which is that? That's the thumb hole. That's that's the only bass. And the saxophone in in the previous track in O'Malley's was called. Um, uh, the saxophone in that track was uh, courtesy of the Roland GW8, which nearly all the keyboards on on these these songs are the Roland GW8. So it's it's real drums, some real drums, real guitars, real um, bass most of the time, and then Roland GW8. No MIDI, just everything had to be played. Okay, so this track does not contain any guitars whatsoever. It lasts 70 minutes, but it doesn't feel like that. Now, if you can really seriously, I'm not kidding, listen to the words. The words tell a story. It's about a girl that goes to Marrakesh to find love, to find a prince. And, of course, this is like an action-adventure love story. Okay, so it has everything. It has the action, the adventure, the love. And it even has the special twist at the end. Okay, so I'm going to sex with me do this. And, uh, yeah, so just just, just enjoy just enjoy it. This is Marika. I must be honest with you. It, I I wrote the music to this, and you have, have to obviously write all the words and sing it and everything. And it is a bit of a, a bit of a... Hard song to sing in parts. But didn't you keep telling me that it were finished? Yeah, and I kept. Then you give me another verse to write. Yeah, the, well, <laughs> it started off like you'd write two, three parts, and everything. No, no, no. I've so got another part to do with this. Oh no, no, no. And it just, it, it's like that. It went, it, it, it just kept going on and on and on. This track, it, as the track actually does keep going on and on and on, but it does change. And um, it was the hardest arrangement uh, I've ever ever done, ever. Even now, it's it's just a nightmare of a track to arrange. So here it is, in all its glory.
So oh, you made it all the way through. <laughs> you made it all the way through. Yeah, we're, we're really proud that I, it took a long, long time to do that. I kid you not. I kid you not. Okay, so what do we do next? Right, okay, so we, so we take it down a notch. We make everyone sad. Uh, okay, so this, um, what, 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 what's, it, what, what's it called now? I, I'm looking for... Um, you're all right, Joe. I'm just. I'm very, very, very warm, it's, people. It's, I am very warm. Okay, so Joe, Joe's Joe's mum died. A long time ago, wasn't it? Though? Um, twenty five years ago, July gone. Mm. So I've been without my mum for half my life now. So, uh, and sometimes she gets very upset with uh, with some of these songs, and we we couldn't. There was a couple she couldn't even do live, but this is this is one called. Uh, say goodbye so but anyone who's ever lost a parent uh this will probably mean something to you or even lost anyone close you know as as we all have um and it's this is a very short piece and then we'll take it up a notch <laughs> we'll, we'll we'll lighten the mood but uh yeah see J spider was only 18 so yeah. so you'll you'll get this you know anyone who's lost a parent or anyone close or anything like that will will get this song um anyway here it is called Say Goodbye. Say goodbye one last time before you go now. One last smile give to me before you leave me. Go to sleep, I will not weep. You're free. So yeah, so that was a it's a that was it's a really short one, but it's a really now stop it again. It's a really we start off on the room. You get looking true. It's my mother. It's, yeah, it's your mum that is. <laughs> right. So yeah, you know, I mean so Renee's loving this track. I lost my dad a few years ago. Yeah, I mean, you know, 
I lost my mum in 2012 and my dad died recently in April. So, yeah, you know, it's... it's uh, 11 years, I think, since I lost my dad. And your dad died 11 years ago, so yeah. it's hard, isn't it, darling? So let's take it up a notch. Remember when you were a kid? Remember when you were... A, you remember when you were a teenager, you had a teenager, like, and you had a crush on someone? I had loads of crushes on girls at my school, but everyone just ignored me. I don't know why. <laughs> right, okay, so uh, this is called a Teenage Crush, and it's literally about... Uh, well, it's about a, 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 a teenage crush. Yes, yes, ladies and gentlemen, Teenage Crush. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, there we go. <laughs> teenage Crush. Yes, we've all had them. I've had Orange Crush and 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 other things that crush. Um, right, okay. Oh, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll play for you the very, 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 very first song we ever recorded together, ever. And it's called Turning. And, and 
Joe also explored a lot of stuff. Why am I talking for you? Joe explored a lot of stuff about growing old. <clears throat> you know, we all have a thing about, we, you know, we, we don't think we do, but we do. You know, we, none of us want to get old. <clears throat> so uh, this is um, a teenage cross, I guess, was part of, part of that as well, wasn't it? Yeah. Being younger, wasn't it? And this is this is called Turning. I one of my favourites, and this is uh, this is one of the fair. I think it's a waltz as well. It is a waltz. <coughs> so oh, thanks, Todd. So, thanks, Todd. But it'll still be on YouTube. Yes, it's very eighties, Tony. It's like I tend to write. I tend to write in a certain year, <laughs> about eighty four. You know, right? Okay, so I'm going to play uh, this one called Turning now, which is uh, it's a like about getting old. was turning and that was the first the first one we ever 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 recorded ever okay so you know uh, if you've got kids <laughs> especially daughters they start to grow up 
you, you, you don't like it, do you? You don't want them to grow up. You want them to behave themselves and they don't. Do you know what I mean? This is what this song is about. Okay, so what is it about Lydia? It is about Lydia. It's about it's about Lydia because she just had she did something very naughty and stayed out too late and didn't go where I thought she was going. This is when we were and in Spain. I so have obviously. never ever done that ever. No, of course you haven't. Me and I'm going. Okay, so this is about uh, so this is about <laughs> this is about when your kids start to grow up. You know, which is inevitable. You know what I mean? It's inevitable. Here we go. So this is called Two Pressures. Her angelic smile and her cherub lips Her sharp blonde hair How their eyes are on her No keys in that one at all. It's just all bass and guitar. And I think it was a, a drum pattern, a drum machine. Okay, so... Um, to make sure it doesn't start off again. This, what's this? This is Fields of Corn. What's this about? I can't remember. 
This is Fields of Corn. I really like this. Um, so I'm going to play two more. I'm going to play this one and uh, I'm going to finish off with uh, 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 another one sort of thing. So because we've done over an hour now and you're all still here. Thanks very much. It's been epic. And uh, thanks for listening to, to us. This song sounds like it could be. Yeah, it's not. It's that bass. It's the bass that I show you. It's yeah, the only the only bass we've ever had. <laughs> yeah, but it means uh, I know it could sound yeah. like yeah, yeah. It'd be really good. Okay, so <clears throat> so this is called um, F Fields of Corn. Fields of Corn. I'm not really sure. Not Fields of Gold, Jose. Fields of Corn. <laughs> but it's a nice song. It's really nice, actually. I really like this song. <clears throat> what is it about? What um, I'll have to listen to. I can't remember. Love. Right. Okay. Because they're really old, these are. I mean, this was last modified nine years ago. Fields of Corn.
Okay, so I'm going to play one more. So that was Fields of Corn. And so this last one is called... <laughs> what? I really did that. That. <laughs> it was the hairy person that stuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so this is this is called a uh, called backwards and forwards oh, before it starts. A sec. So this is the last one. Listen, guys, uh, really thanks, <laughs> thanks for sticking around. Don't forget Thursday night. Thursday night is uh, music night with nine o'clock, not uh, eight o'clock. At nine o'clock with Doug and Colin, where we were playing tracks from one of our albums. I don't know it, but probably the American um, Highway Suite, which which is quite a nice album. Uh, so if you want to join us for that at uh, nine o'clock on Thursday, that's very cool beans as well. Thanks to everyone who joined us tonight. That's absolutely brilliant. I can't believe how many people are watching, actually. You know what I mean? Strike the like, people. Strike it. Oh, look. We've had the... Well, well yes, we've had the, the one dislike. A blessing. <laughs> I wish him nothing but the best. <laughs> Right, okay, so <clears throat> this one is... I shall be back at the end, obviously, to say, hello, hello, goodbye. Um, but, uh, yeah, all the sounds... So every every sound you just listened to, the only keyboard used was the Roland GW8, the old Roland GW8, which was quite a remarkable instrument, actually. But there you go. I shall play... This is called Backwards and Backwards and Forwards.
just a feeling of love, no one else to blame. Everybody dreams the normal pace of life. No silent inner screams. The people all smile now, and the children all play. Young men are not lonely. The old men have no grey. Okay, so that was back. I am going to play one more, <laughs> but seriously, <laughs> uh, the, the Charlotte and Lydia can't listen to this um, this track. So we did, we did, we did four tracks around this time for the Cheringuitos in Spain. We took them, you know, the beach bars, mm. and with this one, it was just it was a bit of fun, really. You know what I mean? In this middle section, I kept saying to Joe, "No, Joe, sex it up, sex it up, make it sexy." So, so you wouldn't believe it. So the, the middle section of this is like X-rated, right? <laughs> it really, it really is. It really is. I kept saying, "No, do it again, sex it up." So apart from the fact that we were all laughing, it was just silly. Um, the, the, but the kids cannot listen to the finished product. So I, I'll play it for you. We weren't going to play this because you know we just um, well we just weren't because it, well you'll hear why we weren't going to bother. But if you take it in the context of what it is. Uh, if you can imagine us in the studio at the time doing take after take of this, because you could only get so far, Joe could only get so far without cracking up, laughing, and then we'd have to do it again. Um, but anyway, this is called Elemental. Yeah. 
no more to that story there's no more to that story it was genuinely what it what we said it was we we just kept i kept saying kept stopping it halfway through the take she didn't want to do it at first and i said no make loads of sex noises it'll be great it'll be brilliant to listen at the end you know oh we can't hardly play that track anyway so i'm gonna play it to you guys now so it's a good 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 fun it's a uh yeah i mean you know it's it, <laughs> it is what it is you've got to be professional professional people we're professionals you know what I mean? So uh, there was no producer's secrets there, Dave. Although I wish there was, there wasn't. <laughs> uh, right, okay, so <laughs> Tony's having hot flushes. So my turn, it's yes. so my mate. Yes, <laughs> and it's got nothing to do with the music. <laughs> right, right, okay. So guys, listen, I, we have got to go now, so. <laughs> okay, listen, uh, thanks for your... I think you pretty, pretty much heard all of them. There are maybe, maybe I don't know, another... Five or six hundred we haven't played. Uh, <laughs> no, I mean, we've got you know, a few we haven't played. I, I played them occasionally during streams of other stuff, but um, it was it was a real pleasure to play these for you. It really was, you know, because we don't, we haven't put them, none of the stuff that you hear tonight. I, I, can't, I don't think so. Maybe one track. Did we put O'Malley's on that album? We might have, done have played that. But anyway. But some of it's on Reverb. Oh, yeah, Nation. some of it's on Reverb Nation as well. And. Um, I need to. I need to vape too, Russ. After that, was it good for you, Joe? <laughs> Amazing that, as always. As it did. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Amazing as always. Right. So, uh, Spider wants you to do a. Uh, we sat some sort of. We do could do some sort of sample pack of you doing oohs and ahs and things. Not the I sex don't noises. Really want some Not the sex no. noises, Joe. No. No. Well, yes, I, I'll, I'll have, I, you've, I haven't sung for a very long time because I've, I just haven't. So, but I might be able to pull out the odd oo and the odd ah. Ooh, ah. Oh, oh, and ah. Ooh, ooh, Mrs. Ooh, ah. Ooh, Mrs. <laughs> ooh, ah. Right, so, okay, so, Dave, if you know the sex noises are an IAP. That's right, Dave, if you want them, you have to pay. <laughs> 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 it can be arranged, though. Right, oh, pardon me. Look, I've got wind now. Oh, I'm all, I'm, oh, I'm all hot misses. <laughs> right, so uh, Ed just put 4 99 in super chat. <laughs> thanks, Ed. Right, okay. Uh, thanks for the well, thanks for this steamy show. <laughs> Listen, it was only the last track that was steamy. Other than the general ambience of this time of year here, it's roasting. We were supposed to be having thunderstorms coming in, but um, oh, I don't know. Uh, maybe, Maybe they will. I hope they do. Could do with a good thunderstorm to clear the air. Do you know what I mean? Much better. What and thunder doesn't bother him, Watson. Right. Okay. So an an, an eighteen plus vocal pack. Don't give her ideas. <laughs> don't, don't give her ideas, Spider. You'll get all sorts of foulness. Right. <coughs> <coughs> I'm joking here. Right. Are you? I am. Right, listen, I really enjoyed that, did you? I did, yes, even though I'm very, very, very warm. I know you are, darling. I'm very, very warm. Who are? Who are? This is. <laughs> right, listen, we're off. <laughs> Thanks very much, guys, seriously, in all seriousness. Don't forget Thursday, me and Colin, and it won't be as steamy as that. I'll tell you that for nothing. <laughs> 
You, you are hot, John. I know, Colin. It's it's uh, very hot. It's it me age. Flipping hot. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's like sleeping next to a radiator. It's not really. You do sleep next to a radiator in spare room, though, don't you? No, I don't sleep. I do not sleep. <laughs> what spare room? <laughs> You've got our bedroom, your studio, and this studio. There's no spare room here. This is a local house for no spare rooms. <laughs> right, guys, listen. I am. I am. De I'm definitely going. I. I seriously could chat. Uh, stay and chat to you all night, but uh, need must and I must eat something now. So listen. Brilliant, top job, cool beans. Thanks very much for watching. It was a blast. It really was. We did get a big kick out of playing the stuff for you as well. And thanks to everyone who watched and turned up and everybody. And uh, poor Joe now has got to go and cool down. So I will see you all soon. And definitely 100% see you. I don't know what we'll be doing tomorrow. I have no idea. But we've got multi-tap delay to sort out from, uh, ultra-tap delay, sorry, from Eventide. And, uh, yeah, listen, Colin, uh, check your email. I sent you something else as well. I don't know if you got it yet, but uh, I hope you did. Listen, guys, I shall see you later. Ta-ta. Thanks. Bye.